All right, here we are. Lightweight concrete ornaments, part three. I like to mix up the stuff dry first. Get it all mixed up nice. And uh, I think I'm gonna add a little bit of uh, set control. I have some set control here that I'm going to add to uh, slow down uh, this rapid set stuff. Because uh, even though it looks like an easy pour here, the molds are small, but uh, there's a little bit of uh, technique involved here. But uh, let's, uh, let's get some of this set control in here. Hey, how you guys doing out there? Yeah. But it's the holiday season. I hope everyone's doing well. And uh, yeah, making concrete ornaments. I mean, whoo-hoo! How much set control do you put in a batch like this, though? Hmm. How's that look? Yeah. little more all right we're gonna go with that we're gonna run with it hey even though it's a small concrete project it's still concrete and it's rapid set but uh, here we go Then, I like to take a little bit of this bonding agent. I like to go uh, I like to go with a little bit of bonding agent. It has some acrylic fortifier in there. And uh, just seems to to make the concrete just a little strong and we'll add a little water all righty yep yeah. now we don't want to we don't want to make the mix too wet to be too dry we want to be able to puddle it nice <clears throat> starting to look pretty good lightweight package Make sure you get all the dry stuff. You don't want to have any dry, dry cement in there that could ruin your your ornament. And you want to make sure this is mixed up nice. I might give it a little more. Give it a little more water there. Got some dry spots in there. So I'll give it a it's kind of a touchy feely thing, you know what I mean? You can tell when you got it just right. And it's gonna work out for you. Yeah, you do it enough years. You're not really guessing, you just know how much it's of everything that you have to add to the mix. Starting to look good here. Woohoo!
Yep. Yeah, it's looking pretty good. I think we're going to get some nice ornaments out of here, I hope. All right. Let's get to work up here, brother. All right, so then what you do... Okay, so you put that in your mold there. You want to puddle them a little bit. Get some of those air bubbles out of there. There's going to be some air bubbles in them, but I think that gives it character. You'll see when, uh, well, if this all works out and when you strip them, when you take them out of these molds, they might have a little air, a few air bubbles in them, but that gives it some character. You don't want them to be perfectly smooth. But, uh, yeah, we're going to see how we did with that uh, set control. That may have, that may give me a little more time. Otherwise, you got to really get going on these. But uh, we're looking good here. Yeah, you can see that uh, we're filling them up. Nice. Oh, the weather outside is frightful, but I'm making something delightful. When you pour the concrete, let it flow, let it flow, let it flow. Oh, you might be feeling. Anyways, I know, I know. So, this is how you do it. Yes, yes, yes. The thing, the stuff, the thing about this rapid, uh, rapid set, even these small little items here, they create, it creates heat when you uh but anyways then what you want to do is you want to take your your reinforcing here and then that's going to go in the in there you want to get your wire through that little notch there get that wire in place put that down You don't want to push it down too far. You don't want it to be revealed on the other side. There's one. Put that off to the side. And keep moving along, brother.